Hi guys, Dashadu27 back again with another episode of Thorak on the Up. This is Season 2, Part 3. If you remember in the last episode, we beat Oldham 5 0. Goals thanks to Bischoff, Karoma, Goni, Adam, France. Karoma got injured, but he's currently back and ready to, for selection. As you can see, we battered them 15 shots compared to their one. Let's have a look how we've done in the rest of the month. After our 5 0 win against Oldham, we lost our first game in the league 2 1 against Oxford. Uh, we were two goals down and Hughes scored with seven minutes to go but we just couldn't get another goal to draw the game. Let's have a look at our next. After losing 2-1 to Oxford we then lost again this time to Knox County. Um, this was a very annoying game mainly because we conceded a goal in the last minute to lose the match. Um, it was a pretty even game, could have gone either way, but Notts County just had enough to get the victory today. Let's have a look how we done in the next match. After losing back-to-back -back games, we then spanked Exeter seven goals, with five goals for Jamil Adam and Dalavella and Aluko also getting onto the score sheet. Let's have a look at how we done in our final game of the month. After battering Exeter 7-1, our inconsistent form continued with a 2-2 draw against Morecambe. We scored the opening goal, but we then fell behind thanks to goals from Sharelv and long with Rosani getting the equaliser. So let's have a look what that all means to the league table. So after 10 games we are a point behind Exeter, Exeter which is funny considering we battered them 7-1. Um, so yeah it's been an okay start to the season obviously from going from the last couple of seasons where we've pretty much won every game it's a bit of a reality check, um, but thankfully in League 2 you get three chances of automatic promotion and you get a slot through the playoffs. So we're playing Barnet today in the live com, who are fourth, who are on the same number of points, but we're ahead because of goal difference. So I'm going to pick my team and then we're going to get cracking with the match. Okay guys, this is the team I've selected for the Barnet match. Curious in goal, these right back, Rosani Bischoff centre back, Smith on the left, Grimondi and Hughes in midfield, with Goni on the right, Morris on the left with Jamil Adam and Karoma up front. We've got Sorin, Torre, Hughes, Cronesby and Dalavella on the bench. So yeah guys let's get cracking with the old match. Hopefully it's a win. Um, I'm not you never know at the minute we're going for a stage of um, anything can happen um, but hopefully we can get back on track with winning ways last two games we've got four points which isn't too bad considering we've played Morecambe and Exeter but hopefully we can get a draw if not a win see what all our coaches are saying I'm going to do what he said so I'm going to calmly say we're the underdogs everyone seems relaxed which is the main thing so yeah guys let, let's see how we do now got kicked off is it going to be a highlight 30 seconds in yep Smith to Karoma to S oh Morris blazes it over the bar Brill with their free kick. Jamil Adams through on goal. Jamil Adams saved by Brill. Adam crosses it and just couldn't find an, an another pl purple shirt in there. 
and Barnet hoof it clear. They're on the attack here. Abdul. Dickinson just over the bar. These to Goni. Oh, poor pass. Rosani, they're through on goal again. And Dickinson's buries it. Not a good start for Tharuk. Come on, boys. Hopefully we'll we'll start scoring. These Tagoni. Jamil Adam. Realistically it's gonna be a hard job to score from where he shot from Morris. Morris crosses it in. Hughes and we've equalised. Probably a fair result at the minute. Hopefully we can push on. Get another goal before half time. Smith with the throw to Karoma. He's put it through. Jamil Adam. Don't know what happened there, but he's blasted the in pass goal, and that's his 50th goal, league goal for Tharuk. And in the matter of a few minutes, we've gone from 1 0 down to being 2 1 up. So hopefully, we can get the third. Smith to Karoma. Oh, brilliant save by Brill, and they've hoofed it clear. Barnet on the attack here, Murray to Holdsworth, Massey, great tackle, Smith, and we're on the counter, Karoma, can he do number five, oh he's, oh, ooh. he didn't do anything, he looked like he was trying to get a corner, but it's ended up being a goal kick, Deering and it's two all, Oh dear, oh dear. It's not working out the way it should do. To all. Morris to Smith. Morris. Going to hit on the counter. Come on, Zani back to the goalie. No, he's hoofed it to their player. Dickinson, and it's 3 2. What is going on? 2 1 up. What is doing you just pass it back to the goalie but instead he wants to hoof it long now Morris has picked up a knock and so is Karoma Ramondi to Adam to Karoma to Goni oh Brill's just tipped it round the post Morris with the corner Rosani Goni Bischoff I don't know why our centre back's dribbling when he could have passed it to Morris. Come on, these to Adam. Whips it in. Oh my god. Morris and Brill's playing amazing. Used to be a Luton goalie. Typical. He was never that good when he played for a Luton, I can tell you that for a start. These to Rosani, to Bischoff. Smith, why are we hoofing it long? Why are we hoofing it long? We play short from the back, and it's a corner to them. Grimondi, that's a counter. It's hoofed it long. Karoma, can he get there? No. It's a We're playing terrible at the minute. I'm going to say certainly I'm not happy with your performance. And I'm going to have to take off Karoma because he's not fit. And I'm going to bring on Cronesbury. I'm going to put Morris up front. And I'm going to take off Rosani and bring on Sorin because he's having a nightmare. And hopefully we'll do a bit better in the second half. just want to get a result a point would be really good away from home to Barnet who are fourth Smith to Morris Cronesbury Goni 3-0 
good goal lads let's not do anything stupid now it's too much space come on close him put a tackle in Oh, they've hit the bar. For God's sake, Smith. Just put a tackle in on Deering, for God's sake. Morris. And they've played it back to Brill. His pass to Lau. Come on, Cronesbury. Smith. Morris. And he's offside. Hughes is in a bit of trouble. I'm going to take him off in a couple of minutes Adam Smith to Jamil Adam to Morris oh, good tackle by their player now they're on the counter these to Hughes good ball to Cronesbury Morris oh it's just gone for a corner Morris whips it in and they've headed it clear Bischoff Morris and he's offside again Got a feeling this match could go either way. I'm gonna have to do that sub take Hughes off. He's practically dying. I'm gonna bring on the other Hughes. And hopefully we can hit him on the counter and score another goal. We've got the players to do it but we're not exactly playing great at the back Goney to Adam back to Goney's whipped it in Cronesbury and again Brills made a great save and it comes for corner Richard Hughes whips it in but Deering clears it for a throw in last 10 minutes of the game squeaky bum time uh oh oh good Morris gets away with a warning here. Brill who's it long. Cronesbury. Jamil Adam. Oh, I thought he was just going to get away. Hughes. Oh, I thought that was going in for a second, but just gone wide. The last few minutes. Oh no. Oh, good, Karis. Come on, let's break. Smith Morris to Cronesbury to Morris what was that Grimondi to Thies to Goni and he's offside how many offsides have we had today Sorin to Goni I've got a really bad feeling they're going to score here. Good tackle, Cronesby. I'll take the draw now. So I'm really worried they're going to score. Oh, come on, Gramondi. Come on, Goni. Get there. Just blow up, ref. I'll take a draw now. And Smith's made a foul, and they're going to get one more chance to score. Oh, no. Bischoff clears it. Come on, ref, just blow up. And it's real. A good point. Probably a fair result. Could have gone either way. So I'm going to say passionately I'm happy. Keep them happy. Some of my defenders were terrible, though, in the match. And we're still second by the looks of it. Okay, let's see what the note says. My computer's been really slow. Goals galore. So let's have a look quickly at the lead table. So we're still second. Steven is now top. Barnet must have lost. Um, it's very tight. But the main thing is to stay in the top three. So let's quickly have a look at the fixtures for the next month and decide what's going to be our live com. We've got Millwall home in the paint trophy we then got Torquay 
at home Accrington away Wimbledon at home Gillingham at home and at the minute our next live com is going to be Stockport away so I hope you've enjoyed this episode guys as you can see we're in a bit of a weird run of form only one win in the last four games but we've played a lot of teams near the top so hopefully we're going to get back to winning ways this month and hopefully we'll stay in the top three okay guys so give me a like for being second in the table in our first season as a professional club i've been dash do 27 give us a like please comment rate and subscribe bang on Thank you.